Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm using my cheap camera right now, so excuse the quality and please excuse the shakiness. But I live in California and I want to let you know or show you what I've been doing the last couple of years to help with water. Uh, water is really expensive here too, so it helps me. Um, I either have a bucket, like a five gallon Home Depot bucket, or I have my watering can, which is even more efficient, right here at the kitchen sink. And the cool thing is that a lot of dirty things that you need to rinse out are actually really nutritious for the soil. For instance, I have this yogurt container that I'm rinsing out. So all this that would be just wasted is a form of calcium and there's other good stuff in there that the soil and the plants are gonna love. Also, all the little bits of food scraps and what have you, that's like compost, you know, that's gonna break down in the soil and be free food for the plants. Now the trick with this, of course, is that you wanna use a good dish soap. So we're using a natural dish soap, so it's much lighter, it doesn't have a lot of poisons in it, and it's concentrated, so you don't have to use a lot of it. Uh, and the soap does not hurt the soil, it actually helps to soften the soil so it'll take in uh, more water and absorb more water. And so I just wanted to show you that we pour very little water down the drain, except for what's in the toilets right now and when I have to use a harsh solution, which is rare. Mainly, almost all of my uh, water that I wash dishes with goes from here into here and then out there into the garden and it's a great way to save water feed your plants and to um, help help with this water crisis and it doesn't take that much time so do what you can be smart the future is going to be all about adaptability take care of yourselves